how to add a gallery in your wordpress hi guys welcome back to another video and in this video i'm gonna show you how you can add a gallery in your wordpress website so having said that let's just jump into the video so first things first what you're gonna do is you're gonna sign into your wordpress account and this is going to be your dashboard over here as you can see everything looks nice everything looks good so what we're going to do now is we're going to go over here onto the left side over here we have a bunch of different options we're going to go over here and navigate ourselves to the plugin section over here and we're going to click on add new plugin all right click on it and it'll take us to the plugins store over here and we're going to go ahead and search for a essentials for elementor now this is essential that you have elementors installed already if you don't you can go ahead and just search for astra and you will find your elementor as well or you can search for elementor itself elementor as you can see if i search for elementor we already have this plugin and as you can see we have already added it now what we're going to do is we're going to add this you know add-on which is essential add-ons for elementor and we're going to go ahead and click on install now wait a couple of seconds for it to be installed and once it's installed you can go ahead and click on activate it to activate the add-on and once it's activated you can just go ahead and move on so as you can see right now uh it's telling us the add-ons so right now we want the basics we have the advanced and we have the customs if we pick this option we want to configure elementor as what we want so we'll just choose recommended and we'll click on continue and then we have our elements over here as you can see we can have all of the elements over here and we can choose which ones to open and which ones to not and we have a bunch of more down below so let's just take a look at all of them and see what we have so we have root product gallery we don't want that for now um, we have the form styles we have the marketing and socials over here we have the pricing tables progress bar interactive circles and many many more so let's just go ahead and choose next then we have the pro version we can choose which one we want and once that's done we can click on next we have our templates over here just simply click on next and we have a bunch of more options that we want so if you want these you can go ahead and add these but if you don't we can leave it blank and we'll just click on next we'll just click on no thanks we're done congratulations it has been installed now it's going to take us over here now what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and open our website all right we're going to visit the site in a new tab as you can see this is how it looks like now what we're going to do is we're going to edit it with elementor so we're going to click on edit with elementor wait a couple of seconds for it to load up we are good to go all right now once we're over here what we want to do is we want to search for gallery all right so we have basic gallery we have filterable galleries we have icon option gallery and so as you can see this one says filterable gallery and it says ea which is like essential add-ons so we'll just go ahead and find a nice place for it to be so we'll just add it over here just above this one and over here as you can see this is how it looks like now what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and edit it so over here as you can see we have six of these all right and we can edit it as we want so we have our settings over here we have our gallery items over here as you can see one two three four five six we can duplicate an item if you want we will have seven and we can delete an item as well if we click on the cross and we can even add an item if we click on add an item button over here and then what we can do is we can add a video over here gallery item we can even edit the text as well so it all depends on us so let me just go ahead and delete that now if we click on each item individually we can edit them individually as well so now what we can do is let's go ahead and add some pictures to it so if i click on the first one over here we can give it a name all right control name we can add in the gallery item we can enable prices if we want enable ratings enable category if we want we can even edit this paragraph over as well and we can even add a media as well and then if we scroll down below we have our image over here we can go ahead and add an image so let's go ahead and choose an image over here we have our media we have our free images over here so let's go ahead and search for it it's powered by pixabay so all the images are gonna be from pixabay as well let's go ahead and add an image first things first uh wait a couple of seconds for it to load up it's still loading up all right so once that's done we can go ahead and add it so let's go ahead and add this one as well the northern lights we we'll click on insert media and boom there we go now as you can see this is it now let's go ahead and name it all right we'll just call it northern lights and boom that's done now what we'll do is we'll go ahead and search for a small biography for northern lights so we'll just search for northern lights all right 
and as you can see this is the uh, small text we'll just copy that just for the sake of this video and we're gonna go ahead and paste it over here and boom as you can see this is how it looks northern lights we get that now that's done let's go ahead and add another image for the second one scroll down all right click on media search for a media as well click on free images and over here we're going to choose another one so we'll just search for mountains let's see if we get some images all right we got some images over here and this one looks good you know okay it's loading up again so let it load all right this one looks good so we'll just go ahead and add that actually click on it and click on insert media and boom we have it so now what we'll do is we'll go over here and we'll change the name to desert mountains all right so as you can see desert mountains same thing let's go ahead and go over here and search for desert mountains all right we'll just copy this small little section over here and just simply paste it over here now we're going to do this a couple of more times and fill out all of this and once we're done we'll just go ahead and save so you get the picture right you just basically you know add an images add some description boom so now i'm just going to go ahead and add some images all right and once that's done just close that up go back down choose an image all right click on free images and search for mountains again and we have a bunch of different you know options so i'm just simply going to go ahead and download all of these images so that i don't have to you know find them on this wall okay that's done move on to the fourth one scroll down choose an image free images mountains and search okay this one looks nice there we go do this for the fifth one as well and then we're done all right so as you can see i've added this up and that's how it's basically done so as you can see these were all of the names and over here these were the gallery items and over here at the top in settings you can show how many images you want the animation duration the columns the grid style the height of the image the layout and everything else over here as well and you can even add more buttons if you want but if not you can keep it safe and once everything is done just simply click on update and it'll update the website all right it's saved now we can just exit the editor if we want and boom that's done so that's how you basically add a gallery into your wordpress website so having said that that is it for this video guys and if you liked this video be sure to hit the like button subscribe to our channel and make sure to turn on your notification bell because if you do that not only will you be helping us out but you'll also be getting daily alerts of whenever we upload our videos we upload daily so you don't have to worry about running out of content so just make sure to hit the bell icon and uh, you'll be notified and you'll be able to consume your daily dose of tech videos and other gadgets and other tools that can help you run or scale your business so having said that i'll catch you guys in the next video and until then take care and goodbye